Hate is a virus. Hate is a virus. Hate is a virus. Hashtag hate is a virus really stemmed from a original idea of having weekly food crawls um, in Los Angeles to support local businesses. So we're at Hamba in Koreatown. Um, you know, with everything that's going on right now, we just really wanted. We just really wanted to support local business, um, businesses that we know are you know, not doing so hot, living in the circumstances, and we're a little bit early, but I was hungry. I couldn't wait. <laughs> we were just trying to figure out the best way to spread the awareness, let our communities and people beyond our circle know what's going on, what we're experiencing, and how people can help. We have three primary campaign goals. One, we're bringing awareness to these issues, not just within our own Asian American communities, but to communities beyond. We're looking for allies to stand in solidarity with our movement. Two, to fundraise for a relief fund. Through Asian Hustle Network, we were able to create a GoFundMe page and our goal is to raise $1 million. The purpose of this relief fund is to help small Asian business owners across the United States alleviate some of their financial burdens felt by the COVID-19. And three, we're looking to educate and equip the community with tactical strategies on how to respond to the hate and racism you witness and or experience in your own communities. So what can you do today? Within just a couple of weeks of launching our campaign, we've already garnered over 4 million impressions. With that said, we're just getting started. We need you to join the movement. You can help us spread the word by posting a photo of yourself and a story of what this movement means to you and tagging hashtag hate is a virus and at hate is a virus. You can also find us on Facebook. There is a hate is a virus filter that you can add onto your profile photo temporarily. Word of mouth is always great. Next time you're talking to your friends or your family, please let them know what's going on and how much it would mean for us to end discrimination and hate and these xenophobic acts that are just dehumanizing. You can also learn more about different ways you can get involved with our movement by going to hateisavirus.world. We're really excited about the power of this movement and hope you are too. Thanks so much for listening.